We're going to talk today about something that not everybody likes to talk about. I am partnering today with Calcium. This is something that not every woman likes to talk about, and that is hair loss. And I know from not only from personal experience, but just from people that have reached out to me since 2020 that are dealing with hair loss. And I have shared on my channel all kinds of hair extensions, clippings, ponytails for people that want thicker hair. Not every woman wants to wear something on their head. Like they don't want to wear hair extensions. They're not into wearing like a hair piece or wigs. And so I'm giving you an alternative. And I feel like it's important to share this information because this is something that men and women both deal with. And what can you do about it? Well, the company reached out to me, Calcium. And when a company reaches out to me, the first thing I do is I research it on my own. I don't just go to the website and hear what they have to say. I want to hear what the general audience has to say. Is it legit? Does it work? Is it real? And what is everybody's thoughts? So I did my homework and I was very, very impressed with what I read and does it work? So the best way to find out is to try it on myself. So before I get to that, I want to tell you about the company. Calcium is a brand that's in its entire line uses growth factor proteins, and that helps to replenish and rejuvenate hair. They also have skin care. What is a growth factor? A growth factor equals messaging signals. It's made up of proteins, stem cells used to communicate to specific growth tissue. When you apply it to your hair or your skin, it signals the cells to speed up the growth rate. And we all know, especially with skin care, as we get older, all of that slows down. So you want to boost it to get it to start working again and work faster than it did when you were 20 years old. And if you're new to my channel, I'm 63. So at my age, it's a snail pace. <laughs> Everything's turning over to snail pace. So what I have is the Advanced Calcium Hair System. And it was developed using Essentialmol, and I may be saying that wrong, stem cells from the um umbilical cord lining. From the umbilical cord lining, you get the richest source of stem cells in the body. When I was researching this, what I saw was, was not just the company selling it or promoting it in doctor's offices. So this is like a professional hair restore system that a lot of doctor offices carry to help you to regrow hair. It restores the hair follicle cycle and it will condition the scalp. It has the AGF basic fibro fibroblast growth factors in it. And when I got it and I opened it up, I thought at first, I thought, I think this is going to be complicated, but it wasn't. You know, when you sometimes when you open things up and you see all these different parts to it, I get intimidated and I think, no, I can't do this. But I can, and it wasn't. This product was actually produced in a stem cell lab. It's globally patented, and it's trusted by doctors, as I stated, and it's ethically derived. So when you get the box, this is what the box looks like. And when I opened it up, so inside of it, it had the vials. So this is the actual product that you're going to put on your scalp. So you'll get packages of these. They're easy open. When you open it up, I have one that's open. This is what's inside of it. You'll get the little top. This is like squishy. And I'll talk about that when I show you how I use it. And then you get a glass vial that looks like this. And that's your product. How far will it go? It depends on how much of your head that you're doing, and I'll talk about that too. This is a little cap. You'll take this cap off. You'll peel off the foil, and then you'll take this, and you'll snap it onto the top. Very simple. Once you do one, once you have one done, this is what it looks like. This is the one that I've been using. I've actually been doing this system now for about six weeks. If you're doing your whole head, like if you have more hair loss and you're working over your entire scalp, that's going to tell you how far this is going to go. I'm not doing it over my whole scalp. My hair back here is pretty thick. The problem that I started having from 2020 from being ill was this right here. I started getting like a recede right there. 
So that's what I wanted to work on. I wanted to see if I, if this was going to make a difference. And it probably will take about four to six months, especially if you're doing your whole head. If you're doing just a small section, you can actually see results in about six weeks. Also, what comes with it is the stamp. I'll show you how to use this. The time that I'm filming this, I have been using this at about six weeks. And I concentrated right here. That's where I wanted to work. And I'll have some before so you can see what my hair looked like before. And then this is what it looks like now. I don't know that you can tell on camera because obviously in six weeks, I'm not going to grow hair that's going to be that long. But when I get really, really close and I look in these sections right here, there's peach, like peach fuzz there that wasn't there before. And on the same thing on this side, it's like I can smooth it down now. I can feel it. So it actually has given me a little bit of hair right here in just that length of time, which is really a very short length of time. I just thought it would look better if I had, especially if I want to wear my hair pulled back, which I do regardless, but I thought it would look better if I could grow right in here. I can take it now. Can you see that? And I can pull it out, which I couldn't do before. So there is hair that I'm feeling like right there, little fine peach fuzz. Before I started doing this, there was nothing there. It was just slick. So I'm excited to see over time, over four to six months, if I can really get a significant fill in right there. Areas that I'm working on are right here in the front. As I showed you in the little clip, this area has thinned. This is thick. My hair back here is all thick like it should be, but not in the front. So what I do is we're just going to take this section right here, and we want to just basically move this hair out of the way. So I've got a little clippy right here. I'm going to clip that back. And so as you can see, right here is the area that I want to work on. So you have the little stamp that looks like this, and this comes off. And this is what it looks like. So if I was to touch this, which I don't want to because it's sterilized, but if I was to touch it, I'm not going to feel anything. But when you st actually stamp it, it moves like this moves up and the little tiny needles will appear. They're so, so super tiny. You can't see them. Before you use it, take an alcohol pad and you want to open it up. Here's my alcohol pad. I have already sterilized this, but this is for demonstration. And you just want to press it down just to really get it sterilized good. And I want to work on this little hairline right here. So I'm just going to clip this back. If you're working on like different sections of your hair, you can take a comb, section it, and go into each, each section. But I'm going to take this and we're just going to stamp it. And it's suggest that you stamp it like four times. So we're going to go this way and I'm pushing in like I'm actually pushing in one, two, three, four, and it'll get red because it's actually pressing into your skin. So it will get red on, on myself. It doesn't hurt. Like I'm not in any kind of pain. I definitely can feel it. Now I'm just going to turn it. Like I went like this. Now I want to turn it. I want to do the same thing. We're just going to stay right there. Little spots, move it around into that little spot where my hair is not as growing there like it used to. And take the bottle, which I've already opened. I'm going to pull the little cap off. The tip of this is like you can't squeeze this, but this you can. So the easiest way that for me to do this is I like to take it and I'm going to pinch the top. And I'm just going to dot around all in the areas that I just used the little applicator. And I'm going to take my finger and I'm going to massage that in. 
I do not wash my hair every day. So if you're wondering, like, can you do this and then, like, not wash your hair? You don't need to wash your hair for at least 24 to 48 hours after you do this, which that works for me because I don't wash my hair every day. And it doesn't mess my hair up. Like, I can do it, just let it dry, and then go to work, and it I don't have any problem. Like, you can't see. It doesn't mess up my hair. It doesn't make my hair, like, greasy or any problems with my hair. This side of my head, it's a little bit different. The where it's receded is a little bit different. So, we're just going to take it, and we're going to stamp it. I can do it relatively quickly. I like to do this, and I usually will wait... 48 hours before I wash my hair. Now I have the product on my hair and you can't tell. All I did was just take that clip out, smooth it down, and it doesn't look like I have like any kind of product. It's not messing up, making my hair look oily, and which is what I like because like I said, I don't wash my hair every day. And when you're using this, you don't want to wash your hair every day. You want this to, to do what it's supposed to do and it needs the time to do that. If you were doing your whole head, just section your hair off, just like I showed you, wherever you feel like you have thin or thinning hair. When I do finish an application, I like to go ahead and clean this. I don't like to like wait until the next time I'm going to do it and then clean it and make sure that it's very clean. And then I'll let it air dry before I put the little cap back on. And so that the next time I use it, it's ready. So you saw how easy it was that I did it. And I do do this a couple of times a week as suggested. And I do have a coupon code and I will leave that linked below with the website, all the information. I think it's a very good alternative to anybody that doesn't want to go to the way of wearing a wig or a toupee or any kind of extensions. I really felt like this was a really good product to share. Because not only as I stated, it is available in a lot of doctor's offices and they actually offer this instead of hair transplants. And you know, if you have any questions, you can leave it in the comment box below. Don't be afraid to reach out to the company and ask them also, do your own research and read about it just like I did. Don't forget to subscribe. I always enjoy meeting new subscribers. Say hi and hit the notification bell if you want to be notified of when I do upload new videos. And I guess that's it. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.